Hey everyone, it's Drea. I decided to go ahead and jump in on the bandwagon and do the TMI questions tag. It has nothing to do with weight loss surgery, but it's more of a fun get to know me situation. So here we go. It's 50 questions long, trying to make this fast so that I don't waste anybody's time. Um, first question is, what are you wearing? That's the reason why I am kind of sitting in a strange way. I wanted to show you. So this is what I'm wearing. Excuse all this crap in the background. I got this from Rue 21. It is a cute um, dress that I got from there and this is gonna be hard to refocus, sorry. It's a little bright. And then I paired them with these cute wedges that I found at Ross. So if you go to Ross, you can find cute wedges every now and then, um, but get them when you can find them because you're not gonna be able to find them again. Second question, have you ever been in love? Yes, I have been in love and I'm currently in love with my husband. Three, have you ever had a terrible breakup? Yes, I had a terrible breakup with my husband. Um, husband now anyways. When we turned 21 years old, I told him, and he calls me a cougar because my birthday is in May, his is in September. We're the same age. But I told him when he turned 21, don't you be doing this BS of I wanna be single now because I'm 21, I need to live my life, blah, blah, blah. And he did just that. So we had a horrible breakup, but it was for the best. We grew as two people separate and then got back together because it was meant to be. And seven years later, we are happily married and going strong. Um, how tall are you? I am 5'8". How much do you weigh? I weighed in last Saturday at 161.6. The 0.6 in the weight loss community means a lot. Um, any tattoos? Yes, I do have tattoos. I actually have a lot of tattoos. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I can count that as seven. Um, I have Carpe Diem on the back of my neck. That is mean seize the day and then I have as you guys know my peanut butter and my jelly is out there um yeah that's my best friend and my tattoo and then on my left shoulder I have my daughter Amelia Marie and I have some hibiscus flowers uh, next to that I have a huge koi with lotus flowers in the middle and then I have a pit bull on my right shoulder and I have Drea with stars around it. I got Drea first because that was my ever first ever tattoo and I had to get my name. I don't know. You know, I mean, just in case you find me in an alleyway somewhere, you know who it is. Anyways, next. Any piercings? Yes, I have my ears pierced. Um, when I was 18, I decided to get my tongue pierced and because I thought I was hot shit and sexy, which by the way, it made me feel sexy. Um, so, and then once I got married, that left, sorry, sexiness out the window. Uh, number eight, OTP. I'm not entirely sure what that means. Um, number nine, favorite show right now, it's Game of Thrones. Uh, oh no, my six, what is it, my five, 600 pound life or something like that? Yeah, something like that. Uh, favorite bands. I really don't have a favorite band. I don't. I don't because I'm really bad at names. Um, 11, something you miss. I miss having friends close to me. Um, I miss my best friend. She doesn't live anywhere near me. Um, and I miss having that um, really close to me. So number 12, favorite song. My favorite song is The Freshman by The Verve Pipe. Love that song. Uh, how old are you? I am 31. Uh, my zodiac sign, which is question number 14, I'm a Taurus. Uh, I am hard-headed, but apparently to all the posts on Facebook, apparently I'm really good in bed too, so mm, TMI for that. Um, number 15, quality you look for in a partner. Uh, he has to be funny. Funny. If you're funny, if you're funny and, you, and you're like, I don't know, I think that's just really, 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 really attractive. So, uh, funny and, and can handle me <laughs> and just good morals, very polite. I'd prefer someone that's close with their parents, um, like my husband is with his mom. I love that. Um, number 16, favorite quote. My favorite quote is, 
People will forget what you said. People will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel. And I believe it's by Anonymous. Um, let's see. Number 17, favorite actor, uh, Denzel Washington, love him. Number 18, favorite color, it used to be orange. I say used to be, look at me, I'm 31 years old and changing my favorite color. I believe now it's, I, I love teal. I love the color teal. It reminds me of the ocean and I love that. Uh, number 19, loud music or soft, uh, very loud. And if it's Mexican music, it makes me want to cook and I don't know. Just be awesome. It makes me feel awesome. Number 20, where do you go when you're sad? Uh, <laughs> besides the pantry? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I go to sleep. Uh, number 21, how long does it take you to shower? Uh, this morning it took me seven minutes. The only reason I knew that is because I'm on a time crunch this week. <laughs> but other than that, probably seven to ten minutes. Hell, I don't know. It depends if I got to shave these uh, stubbly legs I got. Um... How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? It takes me about 10 minutes to get ready in the morning. Maybe add about five minutes onto that because I can never decide what the hell I'm gonna wear. Uh, 23, ever been in a physical fight? Yes, I have been in a physical fight with my sister, with my brother. Um, just to put it out there, I won with my sister, I lost with my brother. Um, let's see, turn on. What's a turn on? Um, I will probably mimic and say what every, a lot of women, if you smell really, really, really good, mm, I love it, love it, love it, love it. Turn off. Somebody thinks, somebody that thinks that they're hot shit, um, that totally turns me off. I, I, don't, I don't like that. 26, the reason I joined YouTube. Uh, I joined YouTube because I wanted to document my weight loss. And I wanted to add a little bit something to the weight loss surgery community. Uh, I wanted to be a part of it, I guess you would say. I didn't want to add to it. I just want to be a part of it. So I really, really crave those kind of friendships. And so far, so good. Have not been disappointed. Number 27, fears. What do I fear? June bugs? I hate June bugs. Um, I'm just kidding. Um, my biggest fear is something bad happening to my daughter. I, I I live in fear with that every single day. And um, also with my, I can't, I can't watch scary movies and little secret fun fact, I cannot lay down in bed and have my appendages, whatever, my arms, whatever, off, off the bed. I have to literally snuggle up and like not hear a sound because I freaked myself out. Um, number 28, last thing that made you cry. The last thing that made me cry was actually my mom. I work with her and that day she made me feel like I was the stupidest person in the world. Um, and I did tell her that and I cried all the way home. Um, it was a horrible day at work that day. Last time you said you love someone, uh, I tell my tell my daughter every day. She just got home. I told her when she got home. Um, I told my husband on the phone about an hour ago because he had to go to work. Um, meaning behind your YouTube name, my name's Drea and I had VSG surgery. So Drea VSG. Last book you read, the Series 6 Securities License Exam... <laughs> book. I am currently trying to get licensed uh, with a series six. So that's the last book I've read. Other than that, I know it sucks, but I don't really read books like that. Um, the book you're currently reading. I'm on chapter nine. So actually I just got to do chapter nine. I'm on chapter 10. Uh, last show you watched. The last show I watched was my 600 pound life. And that was the last show that I watched. Um, Last person you talk to. I talked to my husband today, if that counts, but before him it was Paris. I talked to her. Um, uh, let's see. 35. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. Um, last person I texted was Paris, and the relationship we have, we're besties. She's 
my yin to my yang. She's my wife. She's my other soulmate. Um, number 36, favorite food. Holy crap. Uh, if I got to pinpoint any food, cinnamon rolls. Holy crap. I'm obsessed with those right now. Um, but I also, I, I really just love like mozzarella sticks, um, like, like finger foods, like bar foods, that kind of stuff. I love that kind of stuff. Place you want to visit. I would love to visit anywhere with a beach. Actually, I would love to go back to California. Why? Because I was born there and I would like to go back to where I was born. I was actually born in Los Angeles. Do not remember any of it because my parents left before they it was cool enough to live there. I was born in Canuga Park. So, fun fact for you. <laughs> um, let's see. Last place you were. Last place I was. Um, the last place that I went to... Besides work today, I don't know if this means, it probably means like something like somewhere, somewhere fun, somewhere cool. Uh, I went to Tijuana, Mexico with Paris. Uh, that was, that was actually pretty awesome. I, I would like to go back there. Um, number 39, do you have a crush? Um, besides all my husband and my wife, I do have crushes. Um, Lindsay Fly Girl VSG, I have a crush on her. I have a crush on Lily VSG, Lauren Dayton, Elizabeth. God, there's so many. I need to just scroll through my news feed. Ash Ashley, I'm I'm yeah. Yeah. I have crushes on you guys. Last time you kissed someone, last time I kissed someone was yesterday. I kissed my daughter. You're probably wondering what the heck? Um, it's because my husband works second shift, so we really don't see each other this week. Uh, last time you were insulted. The last time I was insulted. The last time I was insulted was in an elevator with one of my coworkers, and that's when they stated the fact that I had lost a lot of weight, and my husband must be really, really happy now. That was pretty insulting and my sister does a way of insulting me at least one every five conversations so that's kind of hard to determine there. Number 42, we're almost done guys. Favorite flavor of sweet. Favorite flavor of sweet is Dulce de Leche. Um, I love that stuff. Uh, let's see, what instruments do you play? I do not play any instruments. As of right now, I did pay, play the violin back in grade school and I loved it. Uh, favorite piece of jewelry. My favorite piece of jewelry would have to be my wedding ring. I love it. Um, here we go. Last sport you played. The last sport I played was kickball with my husband's family or with my, with my in-laws. Last song you sang. Alanis Morissette, I think. No. No, no, no. We were in the car with my husband. We were we were playing 90s music. Um, I don't want no scrub by TLC. Yeah, I jammed out to that. Uh, favorite chat up line. <laughs> I haven't been on those in a long time. Um, chat up line? Like, what kind of chat up line? Uh, I guess I'm on... I'm on Instant Messenger on Facebook, so I guess that's a fave. Have you ever used it? Oh, they mean like hookup line? Oh gosh, that's been forever. Um, I haven't used a hookup line since I was like 17. So I don't even remember that, I don't even remember it. But if you wanna know any hookup lines, you can go about 3 a.m. and they'll show you all of them on TV. Last time you hung out with anyone. Last time I hung out with anyone was Paris. Uh, that was, God, that was like a month ago. Hmm. I really don't have any friends that are close or people that are worth hanging out with. And I will be hanging out with somebody on Saturday. So that's cool. Who should answer these questions next is number 50. I think, uh, I would love to hear Paris answer them because I feel like everybody <laughs> needs to know a little bit more about your ass. Um, Ashley Wernersbach, I would love to hear from her. Um, 
anyone really. I, I, I know those are the two that stick out to me right now. I know there's so many more. So many more. Um, but yeah, those are the ones that I, I would love to hear from those two and anybody else. It's been 15 minutes. It took me 15 minutes to get through 50 questions, so not bad. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.